ISUPK presents the Lord's 51st annual Passover. All I ever wanted this is crazy, yo. We in the arena. Okay, I can't explain to you the level that is. This place is going to be packed with the children of the Lord shouting in one word and one name to them all. On Thursday, April 9th, 2020, at sundown, we're going to be holding the Lord's 51st annual Passover. I ain't a people pleaser. I don't like people either. I don't care if you're not the jigger and want to meet you. Just give me my motherfucking We're going to be located at the Westchester County Center, 198 Central Ave, White Plains, New York, 10606. $100 for all adults, 17 and over. Kids are for free. Start sending in your funds today. For booking information, check us out on the ISUPK 51st Annual Pass Over Facebook page. More updates will be available soon. Last but not least, Israel, Commandant General Yohanna will be accepting the men willing to stand for the Hebrew Academy 2021. The Lord's 51st Annual Passover. So that quarter spin. We are the ISUPK coming out of Bourne West, 125th Street, all of New York, under Commandant General Yohanna. We've been teaching this truth since 1969 at Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians of the nation of Israel. The ISUPK is not affiliated with any religious group or organization. Tonight, Port of Spain, you have to understand who is the Most High God. You have to understand the working of the Most High God. If we do not understand the working of the Most High God and we see things happening around us, we will be asking ourselves questions and not getting any answers. Good. Tonight, Port of Spain, it's time for you to understand that the Christian church is telling you lies. The book of Acts, chapter 7, and verse 48. When? Howbeit the Most High dwelleth not in temples made with hands. The Most High what? Dwelleth not in temples made with hands. The Most High what? Dwelleth not in temples made with hands. The Most High does not dwell in temples made with hands. So when we stick ourselves up in the Christian church, the Mosai is not there. When we go to church every Sunday, the Mosai is not in that institution. The Mosai himself said he does not dwell in temples made with hands. It's time for us to come out of the Christian church, come out of the Muslim mosque, come out of these institutions and start understanding who the Mosai power is, what does he do, what we need to do to be in good standing with the Mosai before the third world war comes on us because it is coming very soon. Go ahead. Right. right. The book of Exodus, chapter 15 and verse 3. When? The Lord is a man of war. The what? A man of war. The what? A man of war. The book of Exodus, chapter 15 and verse 3. When? The Lord is a man of war. A man of what? A man of war. A man of what? A man of war. Scripture lets you know that the Lord is a man of war. Right. That's right. The Lord right. is not about hugs and kisses. That's right. The Lord is a man of war. The book of Exodus, chapter 50 and verse 3. Wait. The Lord is a man. The Lord is a what? The Lord is a man. The Lord is a what? The Lord is a man. Scripture lets you know that the Lord is a man, not a woman. Not a goddamn spirit. The Lord is a man. Go ahead. The Lord is a man of war. And he is a man of war. The Lord is a man of warfare. And if you are a man of war, what you, guess what you have also? You got to have a goddamn army. And the army of the Lord is the angel. And we're going to get it for you to understand. Because the third world's war is coming upon us and we need to be in good standing with the Lord. We need to come back and keep the most size, laws, commandments and stats. It's time too for us to understand the working of the most size. Because when we go into these Christian institutions, they're not going to teach us these things. They're not going to read these scriptures for us. So we'll be singing all day, we'll be pleading the blood of Jesus, 
and not understanding that the world is a man of war. I form the light. Where the most I form the light. I create darkness. And you also create darkness. I make peace. He makes what? I make peace. The Lord makes peace. Word and create evil. And he creates what? Evil. And he creates what? Evil. And he creates what? Evil. The Lord creates evil. So when we see things happening around us, we will understand the most side creates evil. When we see evil happening around us, scripture lets you know that it's the most side that creates evil. It is not only who is doing it. We must understand that it is coming from the most side. Go ahead, read. The book of Ezekiel. Chapter 9 and verse 4. When? And the Lord said unto him, when? Go through the midst of the city. So the most high is giving the instruction. He's telling the angels, go through the midst of the city. Go ahead. Through the midst of Jerusalem. Through the what? Midst of Jerusalem. Go ahead. And set a mark upon the forehead. And do what? Set a mark upon the forehead. Go ahead. Of the men that sigh and cry uh -huh. for all the abominations. That, that be done in the midst thereof. For the what? For the abominations that be done in the midst thereof. So the most I say, go and put a mark on these men that sigh and cry for all the abominations that's being done. These men that cry out and say, don't smoke weed, don't smoke crack, don't eat more crap, shrimp and lobster. Put a mark on them. This is what the most I say. Go ahead, read. And the others he said, And the what? And the others he said, When? In my hearing, Go ye after him. When? Go ye after him. Through the city, And smite. Let not your eyes spare, Neither have ye pity. The most I said, And those that do not cry and sigh, Go to the midst of the city and smite. What is smite? Kill it. The most I is letting you know, That he kills. Hey. Just like we read in the previous scripture before, the Lord kills. It's time for us to wake up and come out of the Christian church and understand what power we're dealing with. The Lord of the 12 tribes of the nation of Israel. The book of Isaiah, chapter 66, and verse 15. When? For behold, the Lord will come with fire. For what? The Lord will come with fire. For what? The Lord will come with fire. Scripture is letting you know that the Lord is going to come with fire. Go ahead, read. And with his chariots. And with his chariots. Go ahead. Like a whirlwind. Go ahead. To render his anger. To render what? To render his anger. Or to render his love. To render his anger. To render his peace. To render his anger. To render his anger. Let you know that the Moses is angry at something. Go ahead, read. With fury. With what? With fury. With what? With fury. With fury. The Moses is furious. Go ahead, read. And his rebuke. And his what? And his rebuke. Go ahead. With flames of fire. With what? With flames of fire. With juice and cookies. With flames of fire. The book of Isaiah, chapter 66 and verse 15. Go ahead. For behold, For behold. the Lord will come with fire. Go ahead. With his chariots, right. like a whirlwind, right. to render his anger right. with fury right. and rebuke with flames of fire. Right. For by fire, for by what? For by fire, right. and his with, and by his sword, right. will the Lord plead with flesh. So by fire and by the sword, the Most High is going to plead with all flesh. The Book of Isaiah, chapter 14, and verse 21. Right. Prepare slaughter. Prepare what? Prepare slaughter. Wait. For his children. For who? For his children. Moses is letting you know, prepare slaughter for his children. Who is his children? The children of our oppressors. Wait. Prepare slaughter. Wait. For his children. Wait. For the iniquity. For what? For the iniquity. Wait. Of their fathers. For the what? For the iniquity of their fathers. Wait. That they do not rise. The most I let you know, prepare slaughter for the iniquity of the children of our oppressors. Right? That they do not rise. That they what? That they do not rise. Right? Nor possess the land. That they do not rise again in this land. ISUPK presents the Lord's 51st annual Passover. All I ever want this is crazy, yo. We in the arena. Okay, I can't explain to you the level that is. This place is going to be packed with the children of the Lord shouting in one word and one name to them all. On Thursday, 
April 9th, 2020 at sundown. We're going to be holding the Lord's 51st annual Passover. I ain't a people pleaser. I don't like people either. I don't care if you're not the jigger and want to meet you. Just give me my mother. We're going to be located at the Westchester Tell County Jordan Center, 198 Central Ave, right flank, New York, 10606. $100 for all the dark 17 and over. Kids are for free. Start All sending in your funds today. For booking information, check us out on the ISUP page, 51st Annual Passover Facebook page. More updates will be available soon. Last but not least, Israel, Commandant General Yohanna will be accepting the men willing to stand for the Hebrew Academy 2021. The Lord's 51st Annual Passover.